Marcus Conti reporting live from Staten Island once again. We're here at Criminal Court tracking the QAnon killer or the Oxycontin killer, whatever he is. I had the guy who shot uh, about a month ago, shot the Gambino crime boss, Frankie Cali. Anthony Camillo was in court today. I saw him. I was in court. Wow. Found out a lot of stuff. You ready for it? He was there, a little plain blue, blue suit. He looked like a he looked like an altar boy. Clean blue suit, uh, handcuffed behind his back, a little beard on the skinny side. All right, so he walked in there, talked to his lawyer. All right, so what do I know? Not guilty. That's the news right there. Anthony Camillo has, has pleaded not guilty to all charges. And what are those charges? Murder in the second degree, murder one. Actually, it's an A felony. And uh, possession of a loaded gun. Well, I, that's, that's news. You remember the last time I said, oh, he threw, the, he threw the gun in the water. He threw the gun in the water. You remember I said that? Well, it turns out they, they got a gun. Right? They got the gun. All right, so um, so there's, a lot of, there's a lot of evidence that the, uh, that the people have. People versus Anthony Camello. People have... Uh, a death certificate, they have video, they have uh, grand jury minutes, they have search warrants, they have data from his computers. Ah, they got the computer data, right? Was he talking to QAnon? Was he following Q? Was Q queuing him? We're going to find out, man. The attorney, uh, Robert Gottlieb. I got, a, I got an interview with him, so you'll watch that separately. All right? at the press conference. What else do we know? So there'll be a formal bail. He's going to try to make bail. He's a good lawyer, right? He's going to try to get bail for his client. And that will be May 9th. May 9th, a bail hearing to see if he can get like a bracelet or let him out, right? His lawyer makes a uh, argument for the constitutional right, innocent before guilty. We like that, right? So that'll happen. Um, and then uh, there is a June 7th, there's another uh, motion with, to get all, the, all that evidence, to have the evidence move from the people to the attorney so that we can finally get to see him. Because right now, all we get to ask is the attorney questions, and he hasn't seen any of it yet. So we want to know what's in, that, in those hard drives, right? We want to know who he was talking to. What was his motive? Why did he do it? Did it have anything to do with the Gambino guy? Or was it all Q? Or was it the other way around? Or is it the other way around? So the people say they have full video footage of the crime, the actual scene. Fake news is here. They got the video. I wasn't allowed to shoot video. Fucking. I wanted to take a picture inside the courtroom. There's court cameras in the courtroom, but if you're not important enough, you don't get to take a picture. So Channel 7 and Channel 4 were in there, and the local newspaper, Staten Island Advance, were allowed. So it wasn't very diplomatic, really, to get a picture. But we'll see him anyway. So, um, so they have videos of the footage. Anthony Camillo. Right? That's, that's the story, right? He comes out of his... He, he's, he's stalking the, the, the Godfather because they said... Because he said he can't, he can't... He can't see the girl. The girl. It's the story of a girl. Right? The girl, he said... I want to date the girl. I want to date the Gambino girl is his alibi. So what... what I don't see what grounds does a lawyer, what grounds does he enter a plea of not guilty? It almost makes no sense whatsoever, really, because, well, again, until we see the evidence, right? Let, let, the, let, the, let the attorney get the evidence. We'll have a look at that evidence, right? I want to see what's on the hard drive. That's the whole shit right there. Who is he talking to? Where, where's his footprints? Where did the footprints lead? Right? That's the shit. Right? That's the whole thing, right? You can say whatever you want, but where was he looking on the computer? 
Where was his phone? Where was where was he? Where was he walking around? What board was he reading? Was he on eight chan? Fucking where was he, man? That's what we want to find out. Where was he creeping around? Also, what about the brother? What about the what about the what about the brother who beat the shit out of the girl? All right? There's another part of the story that we're gonna find out about. Does it connect to in any way? Can we connect those dots in any way to Camillo? I don't know. Does one crime lead to the other crime? Is it the same group of people? All right? He's not he's pleaded not guilty. Did he not do it? That's hard to believe, right? That's hard to believe. Did he not do it? Whoa. If he didn't do it, whoa. Who did it? <laughs> uh, Marcus Conti reporting on the QAnon killer here in Staten Island, New York, man. It's a nice day out. It's windy. It's windy. It's always windy in Staten Island. What's up with that? Hope you guys could hear me. <laughs> uh, Marcus Conti reporting. 